And now, your first alert five weather. It's going to be a windy day in southern Colorado. We have high wind warnings in effect for parts of our area. Nothing for the immediate front range corridor, but the Sangre de Cristo Mountains and Wet Mountains, also known as the Southern Mountains, are under a high wind warning until 5 p.m. for wind gusts up to 80 miles per hour. These could cause damage, cause some tree branches to fall. Make sure that if you are in these areas and you're driving today that you're vigilant on the roadways for any debris that may be there. Similarly, high wind warning in effect for the Northern Front Range Mountains until 11 p.m., also for 80 mile per hour wind gusts. We've already seen plenty of high wind reports. This one particularly notable last night, west of Trinidad, 91 miles per hour on the eastern side of the Sangre de Cristo Mountains. So definitely take this seriously if you're in these areas. It's not going to be the most extreme wind we've seen ever, but it is going to be significant. Plan accordingly. Now, as we take a look at future wind gusts, uh, wind speeds for us, as we move through the morning, wind speeds will be increasing through the morning in the southern mountains. That is why that warning is in effect and they'll continue to be pretty gusty for us until around 5 p.m. Along the eastern plains, as you can see, 45 mile per hour gusts. So still a very windy day for you, but not quite the same level. And along the Front Range Corridor itself, 30 to 45 mile per hour gusts. So windy day for all of us here in southern Colorado, but particularly in the southwestern mountains. By the evening, this whole weather system that's been giving us all kinds of weather will finally start to move out of here. We'll see calmer conditions. Those winds will start to relax. Your temperature is right now in the mid 30s, a bit warmer than yesterday. We're at 36 in the Springs. Good morning, Pueblo. You are at 32, 27 in Woodland Park and 41 in Canyon City. Now, as we head through the day, temperatures are going to climb the stairs a bit more than yesterday. We'll have a bit more sunshine. We do have that down sloping warm wind as well. So mid 40s for your highs in the springs and low 50s in Pueblo or right around 50 across the area. Upper 40s for us along the eastern plains and upper 30s to low 40s in the hills. Lows tonight, once again, very cold though for us in the 20s to teens across the board. It is winter. Well, no, it's December after all, so it'll feel like December. It's been feeling like December. It will still feel that way today and tonight. Now, as we take a look at satellite and radar, we're also tracking snow along the western slope. We have for the last several days, and you can notice there's not much in the way of cloud cover to the east of the mountains. That's because that uh, airflow is going down from the mountains, and that's part of why we A, don't have clouds, and B, why we have that very intense wind. Now, as we take a look at the big picture, this is all due to the jet stream. It's right over us. Those winds are mixing down towards the ground and bringing in moisture. So that's giving us snow in the western slope and strong winds here along the eastern plains and front range quarter. So in terms of additional snow accumulations, we have winter storm warnings, winter weather advisories, and an avalanche warning in effect for parts of this area today. A lot of things going on. Um, but we're looking at anywhere from another five to 10 inches of snow at our area ski resorts and along the western slope. So if you're heading this way today, be advised roads are going to be slippery. And with the winds, there could be some blowing snow as well. Those pink areas, those are winter storm warnings. And the purple areas are winter weather advisories. The uh, avalanche warning is between Aspen and Gunnison. So it's being hidden by the pink warning that you see on top. Now, as we take a look at your super seven day forecast, temperatures are going to climb the stairs and we're going to really calm down our weather pattern as we head through the week. Six 66 for our high on Wednesday. We'll take it for this time of the year. And for the first night of Hanukkah Thursday, low 60s for you. Clear skies, a great day to get outside. Most of the week follows that trend in Pueblo. Windy today, that's why you see that three out of five storm impact uh, icon on your Sunday before a very nice week, Tuesday through Friday, tons of sunshine, 68 both Wednesday and Thursday. Canyon City, you're in the 60s as well, upper 60s Wednesday and Thursday, well above average for this time of the year. Next weather maker comes in next weekend, cools us back down into the 40s. Woodland Park, you got that wind as well before we are in the 50s on Wednesday. Track our next weather maker coming in for next weekend. All right.